For a long time now, this health center in Kayunga has gone without the necessities that are required of such a unit. It has had no mattresses and neither has it had enough drugs for the patients who report for treatment, in spite of government's efforts to supply health facilities across the country. And last week, angry residents almost lynched the State Minister of Health, James Kakosa, and the area MP Suleiman Madada over what they called neglect of the area. What is not clear is whether drugs had been dispatched to the district health units and did not reach there on time, or the centers had fallen prey to the rampant drug theft. Together with the National Drug Authority, the two officials then quickly organized for a consignment of drugs and mattresses which were quickly delivered to the unit. Uh, we find where non-functional centers, we try to find out on the ground what has been missing mm. and what has been lacking. And really our ministry, we've taken it as a priority that each health center which is non-functional, we are making the facilities better and even to change where we've been to add more so that people can have services in here. Minister Kakoza cautioned the residents to take note of labels on the drugs clearly marked government of Uganda which are allegedly being sold in private drug shops. We alerted people, I've given them my hotline that in any case any drug which they find it in a private clinic which is imposed by Uganda government, I'm empowering the public to inform us so that we can curb that misbehavior which is among ourselves, especially those who are getting drugs from the clinics to sell them privately. Workers at Kokonjero Health Center have been blacklisted for stealing drugs.